What's up, my family, friends, and fans? I literally just recorded the topic that I'm going to talk about right now, but it was 14 minutes long. I rambled so much that nobody's going to fucking finish that video. So here I am again, and I'm going to be fast. All right, my head's got to cover the laundry because I took my laundry out and I threw it on the bed. All right, so this video is to not the... Oh, Jesus Christ, I can't speak. This video is for you to stop being a hating ass bitch. That's what it is, okay? So this is for the females who like to find other females to hate on and uh, like to show the world that they're very miserable. And uh, you know why I can talk about it? It's because I used to be one of those hating ass bitches. And you know what? To be honest, as females, we all have a moment where we're a hating ass bitch. And you know what it says about us? In that moment, we hold up a really big red sign that says, I'm insecure. And this female's making me show it to the world. That is what's happening when we're being a hating ass bitch. Okay, so I don't have those moments anymore. I can honestly, honest to God say, I don't, I'm never a hating ass bitch. I will feel insecure sometimes, slightly, because it's hard to shake me because I'm, I love myself very much now. Now, not always, but now. I love myself so much that there is no, not one person in this whole fucking world that I feel is better than me. And you say, well, what about Kim Kardashian, Serena? And I will say, Kim Kardashian is more attractive than me, but she's not better than me. What is, what, okay, no, okay, Serena. Well, let's take attraction out. What about Ellen DeGeneres? Okay. She, I feel as though my heart is just as big as hers, but she's making it happen. So she's more successful in pursuing that than me. And I admire her very, very much. Shout out to Ellen. Uh, <laughs> but I wouldn't say she's better than me. You know what I mean? Like you have to get to a point where you think that not one person on this earth is better than you because there's only one you. Don't devalue yourself. Okay, so that's where insecurity comes from and that's where anger comes from and then that's where jealousy comes from and then you start to talk shit about other people, predominantly females with other females, which is unfortunate, but we don't, we tend to, and I'm going to say we because I used to be like this, we tend to not want to lift each other up and that is the most stupid thing that we as females excuse you, can do is to try to hold another female back. Don't do that, okay? Do, it, okay, so say this is what brought up this video is one of my friends was like, hey, one of my coworkers talking shit about you. I said, oh, really? What did they say? And they're like, well, they're, they're saying, telling uh, the other coworkers that you can't even really dance, blah, 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 whatever. And I smiled because I'm like, okay, I get a lot of love for my dance videos. A lot of love. I have, okay, this is not, this doesn't mean anything, but I'm just, I'm just going to say this. I have 15,000 people following me for my, my dance videos. Well, maybe it's not just for my dance videos. Maybe because they're a little pervy, pervert persons because I put out modeling stuff too. But regardless, on oh, my dance videos, I get a lot of love. Always, I get a lot of love. And that doesn't validate me. Because see, if nobody likes my dance videos, I would still put them out. Because I don't give a shit. I put them out for me. This is my product. This is what I do. You can like it or you can not like it. I'm still going to get paid. Because best believe, I get paid. Okay? Uh, I teach classes. I get booked places. I get paid to show up places. I'm actually working an event uh, this Saturday that I'm getting uh, a pretty penny for. <laughs> so anyway, so I'm not hurting. The female that's talking shit is obviously hurting. Because they're like, why, why her and not me? Come on, guys. Help me in finding a goddamn flaw. She can't even really dance. That doesn't take away my money it doesn't take away my cuteness and it doesn't take away my followers baby you're just you're just promoting me to the people that haven't seen me yet girl <laughs> you know so but here's the sad part about it is let's go back to the insecurity part she's trying to find something 
that's wrong so she can feel validated. Look at her. Don't you guys agree? She can't even really dance. Yeah, girl, she can't. Does that make her feel better about herself? Because obviously I've triggered something that she's insecure about about herself, right? Because in the past I've done that. I've been like, well, look, she's, I try to find a flaw because to me, the person that's a threat to me is, is like an enemy, right? Like oh, she's threatening my something. I don't know. I don't know what I did to this person. This person doesn't even know me. But I'm threatening their validation because I'm getting all the love and they're not. God damn it. You know? But there's not a scarcity of that. And validation from the outside shouldn't make you feel better. You should already feel good. You should already be like, I am that bitch. And all of my students, I try that to get them there. I want them to be cocky. Walk into the goddamn grocery store knowing you are that bitch. Instead of, I have, oops, excuse me. I have a student that was like, I can't even go in the grocery store without like, because I, I do this confidence coaching, right? Where I have them walk across the room and their chin has to be parallel with the floor or nose in the air. It's just body language um, drills. Because when we go here, we're going inside. This is an unconfident walk. But when you're looking ahead, looking where you're going, you know what you're doing, you're confident, let's go. Your nose is in the air, you're overly confident. You got this, everything. You know, because so body language drills are important. So anyway, she's like, oh girl, I can't even go into the grocery store without going like this or whatever. I was like, okay. So what is the point of this? I ramble a lot. God dang it. It's been, oh, seven minutes. Okay. So anyway. I, so oh yeah, so I want my students to be so proud of themselves, so just so overflowing with confidence and love for themselves that they don't do that. They're not little hating ass bitches that are insecure. So so you, when you do that, when you hate on another female, you're just waving your flag. I'm insecure. I'm insecure. I think this girl is prettier than me, better than me, more successful than me, getting more attention than me. I don't know. Whatever it is that females get insecure about because I I give a shit if I have this many followers that many followers if this person likes my video that person doesn't like my video I don't care I'm still producing I'm still doing what I love regardless of anybody else it feels damn good to me to do a dance and do a dance video or whatever why because that's my passion it doesn't have to be your passion you don't have to like it I like it. It's my life, not your life. I just hit myself in the face with this because of my passion. Anyway, this video is just to remind you to not being a hating ass bitch. Fix your insecurities within yourself and stop. Stut. Okay? Because there's no one else in this world that can be you better than you. So be the best damn version of you that you possibly can. Okay? It's all love. Come to my class. Fix your attitude. Let's go. Remember to be you, nobody else, but beautiful, authentic, wonderfully you.